Well, here is my latest garbage pick. It's a 12 inch fusion table fan from I don't know what year. It doesn't say on the sticker here. But the way it does. So you can see on that little UL listed sticker. Um, the oscillation is messed right up as you can see. Oh, oh it's stuck there. there we go. But yeah, see? Oscillation knobs push down and it still freely rotates, so we know that ain't working. But no big deal. Just a shop fan. Won't really need that. I'd like to put this little 12 incher right there. I've got that 16 inch crappy fan there, but it's you know it's kind of cumbersome and big and stuff can easily hit the blade. At least this one here. It's got half its grill, so a little less liable to get something stuck in there. Most of the garbage pick fans I get work. Well, some of them do anyway. They just need oil, but this one don't need oil at all, and it's burnt out. So I don't know if maybe they had it too close to a wall or something back here, and it couldn't get enough air to breathe for the motor, or maybe they hung a towel or something with lichen on there. Who knows? Or maybe it was just that cheap of a fan, it is a cheap fan, that it just burnt out. No rhyme or reason. I'm gonna bypass the safety fuse and see what happens. See if maybe there's a short in the windings or if it was just simply the safety fuse. Well, here it is with its clothes taken off. You can see, caked the dust. It's kinda greasy too. That little sticker just says three speed fan motor. Type SM12 120 volts. AC 60 Hertz 0.3 amps look at the small stator here And it's only got a 2 microfarad capacitor Oh, yeah, sorry for the wind noise. I have that on because it's just cooking out today And I need a fan on me I'm just gonna take this to the air compressor clean out the outside and then I'll take all this off I'll take the oscillator off first and then I'll take these covers off well, I'm just oiling it real quick. I'm only going to let it soak for about an hour. I already found heat fuse. Right there. It's not even nestled under some wrapping stuff. It's just sitting right there in the open. So i got to snap or snip this little um, string thing here that's holding it in place. And then I'll just uh, push these little wire co covers for the wires back. And I'll just simply twist it together. And it should be a functional fan again. I looked it over and it doesn't look like any windings are burnt. So it doesn't even really look like the motor got super hot. Probably just because they just have really cheap fuses in them. It's a 115 degree Celsius fuse. Okay, the deed is done. She's all wrapped up there. I'll just kind of push it back onto the winding and call it a cigarette, put her back together. Thought I'd show you real quick what went wrong with the oscillator mechanism. It was going like this and I was like, well that feels kind of, you know, loose. And then I went like that. <laughs> I said, well that's not normal. With that screw in there, this shouldn't be able to just pop right out. And yeah, you look in there where the screw is supposed to go on that big gear straight in front that you can see there it's broken right off so this oscillator will never ever work again okay here's the moment of truth I thought I'd just slap the motor together and see if it turns oh yeah doesn't electrocute me <laughs> don't do that if you're trying this don't go and touch it to see if it electrocutes you you know there's there's a better way of doing that but you know I'm, I just jump the gun and give her a little tap and if I get a zap then something's not right and she's getting power to the case but in this case we're good I'll slap the rest of it together and see how it operates. Okay, right, shut off the other fans there so you can hear it. And here we go. Start off with low.
Oh, that's a quiet fan. Good air mover, too. I'm already liking it. Medium. of air it moves, for how quiet it is, this is a real score. Some broken bit of casing there. I'm impressed. Great right there. Quieter than that thing. much nicer. Of course the wind comes up starts making my exhaust fan mad. Anyways that concludes this video. I'd say it was a great success. Other than the oscillator not working. <laughs> Made her noisy. That was a nice range of tilt. Right on. Thanks for watching. <laughs> I started the camera and I didn't even light my smoke. And I don't have my lighter. Really? I swear I dropped the thing. Come on. Crud on my lens again. Oh, I'm so sick of cameras not focusing. It's a 12 inch Fusion 12, um, bleh. 